Welcome back to Dark Horse Sports Cards. This is Sage, and it is time for some baseball. I know some of you have been waiting for baseball, and here it is. The first product of the year, 2024 Series 1 Tops Baseball. I've been waiting for this. I tried to pre-order it. It was sold out in a day, and I missed it. I was so sad. I was able to find it at Dave and Adam's card shop, and they ship pretty quick, and I was very impressed. This just came out very recently, and I got it in my hands, and I want to open it up. So first, we're going to go. I got a bunch of different product here, uh, but we're going to start with the hobby box. Now, unlike, unlike uh, other sports, this hobby box is pretty cheap. It's only like 90 bucks. So I said... To Brody, let's let's definitely get a hobby box. Let's get a bunch of these things. So here we are. Uh, an NBA NFL hobby box, good product, mm, thousand bucks. Baseball, hundred bucks. Love it. However, this is this is a paper product. Looks like we got a silver pack here. We'll save that. This is a paper product. Ooh, there's a lot of packs. I better get going quick. Uh, I prefer, personally, I love Topps Chrome. Topps Chrome is my favorite set. This is Topps Chrome's little brother, and this is the paper version. However, a couple new things about this one. Uh, there's a brand new design, and everybody's raving about this design. I guess there's new cardstock, too, and the technology got uh, more advanced enough so they could go through this design. The top three rookies that we're looking for. There's a ton of rookies, but the top three are Ellie De La Cruz, Evan Carter, who dominated in the World Series, and the last one is Jason Dominguez. That's right. I got a list here of all the rookies, and Jason Dominguez goes by the Martian. All right. There is a bunch of packs. Uh, I guess it says right here. And the and the odds of the box, the odds for all the parallels and everything are no longer on the box. They moved it. So they changed a bunch of things. I think Fanatics and Tops are changing some things. So let me see. There is 20 packs and 12 cards per pack. So let's dive in. First baseball product, first baseball rip of the year. Tons of different parallels. One of the things that they did this year is the cards are all going the same way. Who would have thought that? And by same way, I mean... Ooh, here we go. They're all like vertical. Okay, let me get set up here. Matt Olson, and now we get to see the design with the black on top. I like it, and the cards feel the cards feel good. So hopefully you can see it there. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to go a little slow in the first couple packs, get the hang of it. Brian De La Cruz. This guy was all right. And... I don't know. As I go through, I'll tell some stories about players. Let me get situated here and kind of tell you the rookies that we're looking for. And I actually never seen this product open, so I'm kind of in blind here. And here we go. Diamondbacks, Corbin Carroll. So that is the hit of the pack. Okay, so there's not going to be that many hits in this. The we got a we got a jumbo hobby and that's what I've seen open. I've never seen this open, so I'm a little blind. But um, here it is, and I guess 35 years ago was it? 1989 is uh, kind of an insert, and that was Ken Griffey Jr.'s rookie year. And his tops rookie card is one of the most iconic rookie cards of all time. Okay, so pack one, kind of a bust. And uh, we're just looking for any color and any good rookies here. Spencer Horwitz, never heard of him. Not a notable rookie. Okay, this guy's a this guy's a notable rookie. He's on some lists. Julio. Devon, Brendan Donovan. And wow, what timing! All right, King Griffey Jr. Celebration of the kid. This is what I was talking about. Uh, um. Since his rookie card is one of the most iconic rookie cards, this is kind of like a th throwback set to him and a throwback. Uh... Wow. Throwback, um, I guess, 
celebration. Patrick Corbin, awful. Davis Schneider, okay. This is guy's a good rookie. He's got some potential. He came up last year. was batting 400 for like a lot of days. He had a good start for the Blue Jays. And uh, I know we do a lot of football on this channel. Thanks for staying with us. And hopefully uh, you guys will enjoy some baseball too. And if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe. All right, here we go. Ooh, f future stars, Grayson Rodriguez. Nestor Cortez Jr. Here's an insert. Nolan Arenado. Just a good look at one of these inserts. I forget what this one is called exactly. Remind me in the comments if you know. Evan Longoria? Okay, so... This product is a, is on the cheaper end. You shouldn't expect to get your money back or really even close. This is just kind of fun. I really like the new design. Keaton Wynn. Never heard of him. He's not a rookie we're chasing. Tatis Jr. Okay, this guy has been a top prospect. Marco Luciano. He's been a top prospect, prospect for a long time. We'll see what he can do for the Giants this year. He's definitely going in a, in a pile by himself here. One of the top rookies. Okay, backwards card. Here we go. Oh, it's a thick boy. Okay. I'm gonna set I'm gonna set this thick boy down. That's our that's our hit of the whole that's our hit of the whole box. We're gonna save that to the end. And let's get ripping. All right. I'm so excited. Football is over and baseball has begun. Spring training's gonna start soon. Before you know it, it's gonna be opening day. Brian Wu, he had a great great second half. Miguel Cabrera, see you later. Curtis Mead, he this is a top guy. Okay, the Rays always have great rookies. Mickey and Walker Bueller. So, yeah, let me know what you think. Um, I got my Phillies jersey on here today, and I uh, got the Phillies. Alec Bohm here, and it's it's a really nice design. Very interesting. I saw a lot of people were saying, I'm going to collect the whole set. I'm like, oh, I don't know about that. But uh, there's a lot less base cards. And I think people were complaining. You just get too many bases in these hobbies. Got to sit right here. So they decided, well, let's lower the base. Oh, here we go. Jordan Westberg. He's a top rookie. We'll put him down. He's who we're looking for. Oh, I see an insert back there. Luis Matos. He's all right. And what do we got here? Oh, Grand Gamers. Clayton Kershaw. Not bad, not bad. And for the insert, I, he just re-signed with the Dodgers. Luis Robert Jr., all right. Brent Rooker, oh, this is his walk-off home run. He had a couple walk-offs last year. I was watching them. I'm trying to, slowly becoming an A's fan as they move in quest to Las Vegas. All right, let's see what we got here. We're still looking for some of the big three. Stone Garrett. And any any numbered cards would be amazing. They really lowered the number numbered cards here. Arcia, Garcia, Sodersum, he's okay. Catcher for the A's. Vladimir Guerrero. Brady Singer. Don't know what this is. Students of the game. Jake Fraley. Okay, that was a nothing pack. We're gonna have a couple nothing packs here. Hopefully, uh we want to see some color. We want to see a super fractor. We want to see some one of ones. Christian Yelich off the off the top. Okay. Barrios. Isaiah Campbell. Figo. Henry Davis. Okay, he's a top catcher. He, I think he was the number one pick of the draft a couple years ago. We'll definitely put him over here. Tyler Glass now. Now on the Dodgers, the loaded Dodgers. Zach Allen. Okay, Riley Green. He was a hot rookie last year. Brian Hayes, also a hot rookie. Oh, Riley Green again. So we are cruising right along halfway through. One of many baseball openings. This set just came out, and everybody's talking about it, so I had to pop it open here. Jose Rodriguez, he's all right. Juan Soto now on the Yankees. Yankees are loaded. At least their lineup is. Catman, Tony Gonsolin. He puts real cat fur on his uh, cleats. 
Okay, not much here. I can I can see it now. Uh, I can see it now. The super fractor is, is coming. We're halfway through. All right, Yanir Diaz, Johnny DeLuca, Hunter Green throws 101 miles per hour. Brandon Marsh, he's got a cool beard. And Pete Alonzo, the polar bear. Oh, and here we are, Jason Dominguez, the Martian. This is exactly who we wanted to see. All right, bud. You're going to get on the stand. This is our first. Nice. And these cards are very, very, very uh, papery still. Um, as mentioned, they're kind of like more of the chrome cards. I don't open too much. Ooh, O'Neill Cruz. He was one of the top rookies last year. I don't open too much baseball. Bobby Miller. Stud for the Dodgers, future stars. I don't open too much paper baseball, honestly. I do love Topps Chrome, but this set is growing on me. Home run challenges. All right. So this is cool. So this is a challenge. You got to scratch it off and you submit. And if Tatis Jr. hits a home run during this game, you win a special card. Okay, this is backwards. Maybe for nothing, but this is one of the top guys. Oh, Andy Rodriguez, okay. He's in, he's actually injured right now, but this is a nice rainbow foil of Andy Rodriguez, and he's one of the top prospects. A couple lists had Andy Rodriguez in the top five. I was like, okay. He was a Pirates fan who had him in the top five, but this is not a bad rookie. Andy Rodriguez, welcome to the stands. So two hits so far. The rookies are coming out. Uh, there is a lot of rookies in this set. And that's why I really like 2024 is I was going through the rookie checklist. My guy, Zach Giloff for the A's. He's great. And I got to pick up the pace here because I'm not trying to make this a super long video. We got a lot of baseball going. Uh, just a super deep rookie class. Curtis Mead, he's one of them. Matt McLean. Mitch Keller. Oh, Aaron Judge. All right. All right. We'll keep going. A couple more packs left. We got the Thick Boy down there, and we have the four silver pack at the end, too. So, uh, continue to cruise along here. Emerson Hancock. The, the Mariners will be nice this year. They got a good rotation. And, uh, they made some trades. We'll see if they can finally get, sneak into the playoffs. I love a, a Cunha Jr. at the top of the pack. 70-something steals last year. The rules, he really took advantage of the, the new rules with the new bases. Zach Wheeler, okay. Logan O'Hop. Shay Lingaliers, that's a cool-looking card. Is that just how the A's are? Clayton Kershaw again. All right, cruising right along. Thanks for joining us. And uh, if you like baseball, we got a lot more to come. So please leave a comment and tell me, hey, open more baseball. We like it. I'm still getting uh, set up here and situated. As you guys all know, Brody does a lot of the openings here, so... Brody said, you know, I don't know anything about baseball. I'm going to have Brody join me for the jumbo box. Michael Harris, is this uh, special? Ooh, pink. Is this numbered? Ooh, it is numbered. All right. I should have maybe said, just get it. I've like never, I watched a couple box openings. I've never seen a numbered card. All right, I am stoked with this. Unfortunately, it's not his rookie, but one of the first box openings we did uh, back when I back when we first started, we got a sweet Michael Harris rookie auto. So this guy is sweet, and it's a pink out of fifty. Okay, I was just happy to see one number card. I wasn't sure we were going to even get one, but uh, yeah. I, 
I'm going to continue. I've been getting into, I've been into baseball my whole life, watching the game, fantasy baseball, but I'm getting more and more into uh, trading cards throughout, um, I guess, 2020 to 2021. My brother was taking me through all the different options. So there, there'll be five major releases throughout the year, top series one, top series two, Tops Update, and those are all paper. Another backwards card, it looks like it's a Justin Verlander, and then Tops Chrome and Tops Chrome Update. So, this, let's see. Okay, Verlander, Rainbow Foil. So, uh, and it comes in, each one of those five releases comes in different types of product retail and hobby boxes this is the hobby box they also come in the jumbo hobby and then a couple retail products we'll go through some of them this one you only, you're not guaranteed an autograph and you only get one relic or one autograph and that's why it's a little bit cheaper this is a great product if you're just getting into baseball cards because you don't break the bank christopher Merrill, future stars and then of course they have uh bowman products but that's mostly up and comers so we opened a couple of those on the channel already um patrick wisdom all right glaber taurus all right couple packs left there was a lot of packs in here i was not really prepared for this starling Marte, and a lot of kind of packs without a hits corbin carroll chris taylor byron buxton i'll never forget chris taylor's walk off against the cardinals Seiya Suzuki, this guy we got a 101 on. We're waiting for it in the mail. A Leaf 101, Seiya Suzuki. All right, two packs left. Thanks for sticking with me. There's going to be a lot more baseball to come. And, uh, yeah, I got – hopefully uh, I have some good stories about players. I was watching people opening packs, and I was like, they don't really tell stories. So I guess maybe I'll do that. Kubrick Rees, he was traded – for my guy, Trey Turner, from the Dodgers. Pete Alonzo, just, cr oh, and here's our guy, Evan Carter. You love to see this. I'll sleeve that later, but that is one of the top rookies, and he just dominated the postseason. If you watch, oh, Shohei, you love to see that. I will be sleeving all of those. I'm just going to go a little quicker. Large new bar. Okay, what is this? Oh, it's a gold to 2024. They always throw in some golds and they number it out of the year. So our second number card. All right. Yeah, what I was saying is Evan Carter just dominated the World Series, the postseason. The guy's batting three and he's a rookie. I think he's 23 years old. So he's one of the top rookies. We've gotten a lot of them. Jason Dominguez, Evan Carter, and uh, we're just missing L.A. De La Cruz. That's all we're missing is the number one guy. But, yeah, this has been a great great box so far as, far as action. Like I said, you don't really buy this to um, get a ton of value or get rich. You have to get really lucky to make some money in this. Uh, Zach, Reed Detmers. All right. And there's the last pack. Okay, so should we do the silver pack or should we do the the patch? I guess let's do this. Let's let's get the patch out of the way here. All right, here we go. You made it this far, or you fast forwarded to the patch. Either way, let me know in the comments if you waited patiently or you just clicked through. Let's see. Maybe. Oh, it's a red. Could that be Ellie De La Cruz? Gonna go from the back. Um, the moment we all been waiting for. Jeremy Pena. Okay, would have been good last year as he was rookie or two years ago. Game used memorabilia. Congratulations. Here's your 1989 Topps Baseball Relic Card. All right, I'm not too excited about it, but it seems game used. This memorabilia contained on this card is not from any specific game event or season. I thought they were going to do better with this. 
All right, they're still working on that. Okay, silver pack and we're done. And product number one, baseball, is in the books. We'll do a quick recap. Okay, Chris Bryant. There is a chance at an autograph in here. <laughs> For a second, that was an autograph. <laughs> but this is uh, advertising another product. Okay, Chris Bryant. This is Topps Chrome. Andrew Abbott. Don't know this guy. Barry Larkin. Barry Larkin was one of the first baseball jerseys ever, I ever owned. Um, they were The Reds were the first to do the sleeveless, and uh, I had to have one. So I got a, I got a Reds Barry Larkin sleeveless jersey when I was a little kid. All right, last card. Matt Olson, the big bomber for the, for the Braves. All right, let's do a quick recap here. I'm a little disorganized. I didn't realize how many packs there were. I wasn't trying to make a... 45 minute video here. Um, so we'll quickly go through the recap and I'll try not to ruin any cards. All right, Lars Newbar Gold, Justin Verlander Rainbow Fold, Foil, Michael Harris out of 50. That's pretty sweet. Jason Dominguez, The Martian. This guy's a big guy too. He reminds me of Judge. Him and Judge back to back. He's coming back from an injury. He should be back hopefully. In a month or two on the season? I don't know. When's he coming back? If you know when he's coming back, let me know. Andy Rodriguez. This is nice here. And then I put some of the more notable cards over here that I've yet to sleeve. Jeremy Pena. Shohei. Shohei's always the man. This is not a notable card. This is a not a notable card. Here we go. Evan Carter. Love that. Henry Davis. Love that. And Marco Luciano, love that. I got a lot of the good rookies. I'd say out of the top 10 rookies, we got seven or eight of them. So I will call this a success. I don't know the comps on these cards. The products just come out. But uh, we will do a financial review video of all of these cards and kind of breaking down after a couple, of the, couple more sales. So thanks for tuning in. Sorry, this got a little long. There was a ton of packs. If you want some more of this and you want Dark Horse Sports cards to keep buying baseball products and opening them, please give this video a like and comment down below what, who are the rookies that you're chasing? Who are, um, are you, and do you, do you like this logo, this design? Tell me stuff. Let's chat in the comments. I'll reply to every comment on this video. All right, Silver Sage, Dark Horse Sports cards, keep ripping those packs.